guys so today i have personified clostridium perfringens now this lady here is clostridium she is wearing a cap hence capsulated she is wearing a face mask hence she does not require oxygen she is anaerobic she is gram positive commensal of large intestine now because she lives in the large intestine she causes gas gangrene food poisoning gastroenteritis necrotizing enteritis the belt she is wearing a belt which demonstrates subterminal position of the spore she produces mainly four main toxins that is alpha beta epsilon and iota she has two characteristic specific test that is the nagler reaction and the reverse camp test that is christy atkins munch peterson now this here is a thunderstorm thunderstorm lightning which shows that she shows stormy fermentation that means she is kind of lactose intolerant that in litmus milk she ferments lactose produces acid that coagulates casein and which shows causes stormy fermentation now the main important point for clostridium perfringens is that the spores disappear when cultured whereas for clostridium tetanae and botulinum they do not and as she is anaerobic she can be cultured in anaerobic media like thioglycolate and robertson cooked media